What's up guys, Marlon here back with another massive news video for you guys and girls today. So let's not waste any time. Let's get right off into it and we're starting off here with Mr. Kimishima talks about Nintendo is aiming to improve Switch Online service to make it worth paying for. So remember back in May, that Nintendo talked about their online service briefly. They didn't really go into too much details and there's really not a lot of value here except for the NES games and also um, the online that you're gonna have to pay for for some of the games like Splatoon 2 and Mario Kart 8 as well as cloud save functionality but not on all the games. We still don't have local saves back up at all and we need some more incentives so Kimishima basically states that hey they're working on more value to give us this online and I feel like it's fair because if we're gonna be paying for this it needs to be something more than just NES games what about giving us some Wii U games for free every month what about giving us some Nintendo switch games similar to what PlayStation have with the PlayStation Plus model I love the PlayStation Plus I feel like it's one of the best online membership deals that you can ever pay for I mean you get free games you get cloud save I mean there's a host of features you guys know all those features so I feel like if they really want to be successful look at what Microsoft is doing and look at what Sony is doing but this is really good that Nintendo is trying their best to ump up and beef up the abilities of the Nintendo switch online and best believe I will be purchasing it but I feel like if they're gonna be ditching the virtual console they need to make it a lot more uh, worth it all right guys let's jump off to the next part of the news video here so sakurai talks his approach to super smash brothers ultimate choosing creating items working on taunts and more so sakurai pretty much was talking about you know smash ultimate with nintendo so nintendo pretty much interviewed him and he was talking about the past you know smash brothers games and so i'm not going to read the whole entire interview link will be down in the description down below so nintendo asked him how was your approach to this game different than your approach to the past super smash brothers games what did you want to achieve with this game this is what sakurai had to say he said that the difference between this game and the past is that all the characters are in it we really tried our best to make the impossible possible to prevent situations where someone misses a certain character because they have been cut so he talked about that also he talked about melee and how it was more geared towards a core audience he also talked about the wii u version and the 3ds version and basically talk about the tempo or the pace of of those smash brothers games as well as he talked about his favorite taunt in the game which is ridley but he states that he loves all of them cannot wait for super smash brothers ultimate this game is definitely one of the best smash brothers games hands down in the series i would say since brawl because brawl is like my favorite one out of all of them melee was good but it had a lot of technical issues or whatnot that's just my opinion but a lot of people are just going insane right now because waluigi is not in the game and i'm just thankful that we have every single character except him that's okay but there's even more dlc characters possibly in the future with you know smash directs and whatnot so the hype is definitely real for this game i love the fact that we're getting so many stages almost all the characters it's a brand new game with a brand new engine a lot of people are saying oh no it's it's a port and oh no it looks like the wii u version trust me this game looks a lot better than the wii u version all right guys let's move on to the next part of the news video here so apparently this is real huge the first nintendo certified portable charger is now on sale this is real huge 
especially on the go here. So they have two different power lines here. There is a 13400 Nintendo Switch edition for $69.99 and they also have a power core edition with this one is the 2100 Nintendo Switch edition for $89.99. So the 2100 uh, Nintendo Switch edition provides up to an additional 15 hours of playtime on a single charge while the 13400 edition will give you 10 hours according to anchor so their anchor is the, basically the ones who are actually making this for nintendo i think this is a steal for 15 hours worth of playtime on a single charge so link would be down in the description down below for you guys to read up on more of this all right guys let's move on to the semi to last part of the news video here so basically this is real huge xbox 2 release date rumors xbox president confirms multiple Xbox One X successors. So yes, apparently we're gonna be getting multiple versions of the next Xbox that is rumored to be coming out in 2020. And apparently we should be getting a huge surprise at E3 next year. So we should be getting an Xbox Two or whatever it's gonna be called next year. So the hype is definitely real for this and apparently you know the xbox 2 is currently in production so i cannot wait to see what microsoft is going to do the fact that they bought out what five new studios uh during this past e3 that they were talking about i think the future definitely looks bright because one of the things that really kills microsoft is no exclusives they have the third party deals and they have the third party games everybody had third party games or whatnot but you need exclusive games exclusive games is what sells your console microsoft so please learn from your mistake with the xbox one right now and focus on your future with the xbox i mean if they fail with this next xbox i don't see how microsoft is going to bounce back from that and then the last bit of news that we have for y'all today is microsoft just dropped a xbox wireless controller it's a sport white a special edition and it's diamond gripped for enhanced comfort and this looks really good it will be on sale on august 7th 2018 so let me know if you're going to pick that up all right guys that ends off today's news video if you enjoyed it please smash a staggering 150 likes let me know you guys want more news videos like this moving forward subscribe if you're brand new to the channel turn on that notification bell to join the brotherhood that we have here and peace switch gang nation love you guys we out of here